Hello friends, this is Shiva Shankar from Safety Hands with a new video. In this video, I am going to explain about the hazardous area classifications and how it is classified in an oil and gas industries. So, what is hazardous area? Hazardous area is an area where flammable or explosive atmosphere is present in such a quantity which can create health and safety issues to employees or workers. So what is an explosive atmosphere? Explosive atmosphere is a atmosphere where flammable substance will be present for longer duration it is known as uh, explosive atmosphere. So hazardous areas are classified into zones. So the basic concept behind the zone is that uh, the duration and frequencies of uh, hazardous uh, substance, I mean the flammable and explosive substance present in air is depend upon how we classify the zones. Zones are classified into two major categories, gas and vapor zones and dust zones. Under gas and vapor zones, it is classified into three categories, zone 0, zone 1 and zone 2. Zone 0 is an area where uh, flammable or explosive atmosphere present for longer duration continuously under normal operation condition so uh, zone 1 zone 1 is an area where flammable and explosive atmosphere is likely to present under the normal operation condition and zone 2 is a area so where the flammable and explosive atmosphere uh, will not present in normal operation condition but if there is any maintenance work is in progress definitely there will be a presence of flammable and explosive atmosphere that too for a short period of time so let's see what is hazardous dust area so dust area is classified into zone 20 zone 21 and zone 22 zone 20 is a presence of uh, flammable and explosive dust uh, for continuous period of time and zone 21 is a presence of uh, uh, flammable and combustible dust it may likely to be present and uh, zone 22 is an area under normal operation condition the presence of uh, flammable and combustible dust will not be there but if there is any maintenance or any operation uh, maintenance is going on definitely there will be a presence of uh, flammable and combustible dust so let's see uh, the gas and vapor groups so gas and vapor groups are further divided into three categories that is 2a 2b and 2c so under 2a the gases like methane ethane propane is going to be there and under second b 2b i mean so the gases like h2s which is hydrogen sulfide and ethylene will be there and 2c hydrogen and acetylenes are the best examples so similarly dust groups are there it is also classified into three zones so 3a 3b and 3c 3a means it's a combustible dust and 3b is non-conductive dust and 3c is conductive dust so the temperature classification is also one of the most important in an oil and gas industries it ranges from t1 to t6 it has its own temperature range please refer to this table for uh, more information on temperature ranges for example if any equipment is marked t3 in this uh, image so that temperature will will not be exceeded in that uh, equipment if that temperature is exceeded definitely the equipment is going to be malfunction uh, that's all in this video my friends if you have any clarification on what I have just said so far, uh, please comment me down. I'll be happy to explain you back. Thank you. Thank you for watching it.